and uh, let's get food out of it. It's fun. Um, dates all the way back to 9,000 BC, where there was uh, caveman drawings on like the walls that they used for hunting. Yeah, right there. Um, as um, time went on, eventually turned it into a weapon for war. Obviously, yeah, right there. Um, I guess back then it was probably a pretty good means of something used for war. Um, it was easy, probably to like carry around stuff like that. But um, they usually they stopped using it once it got to the 16th century when they um, uh, invented gunpowder. Obviously. then they've came a ways. Um, uh, yeah, so now today they're built out of like uh, metal, aluminum, plastic, stuff like that. Um, they're really easy to shoot. Um, basically what you're going to do is you put this little piece as a clip right there, stick it through uh, right here, this little screen right there. You set it on the front of the bow, and then you just draw back. You draw back, and then you should be looking through this little hole. And then it's that took a lot of sights, but depending on how far away the thing is that you're shooting at, you would put that pin on whatever you're shooting at. Really simple. Um, today, I guess, yeah, hunting isn't really used in war anymore. It's more of just like a, I don't know, a hobby kind of thing. More for just hunting, stuff like that. Um, usually, if you're bow hunting, you're not going to be hunting anything that is flying. That's probably pretty hard. So you're going to be hunting stuff like deer, turkey. Stuff that's pretty stays to the ground, stuff like that. And um, most of the time, you're gonna be sitting in a stand, probably 10 to 12 feet up in a tree, so that way you are less visible. Or if you're gonna be on the ground, you're probably gonna have to be pretty well hidden. And um, yeah, like I said, it's just been a